Hello, everybody. Lauren Pibworth here, and welcome to the Pibworth Summer Boardroom. I love being able to record my live videos out here, and I'm hoping that you're able to see and hear me because I actually think I may have gotten my headset working. We'll see. If this is just a bunch of mime, then maybe you can let me know. But um, I'm testing out um, some new things today, and we're going to talk technology. So uh, I'm I'm just I'm so glad that you're here. Woodrow and I are hanging out. He's out sniffing lord only knows what but uh he's doing it so <laughs> that's awesome and uh so we're going to test out some of the be live um thank you pat i appreciate you telling me that. <laughs> pat says so she can hear me um i asked her to pop over and just make sure that she could actually you know that i wasn't miming so thank you for doing that i, I appreciate that um so it's really cool to have uh, to have some people live i see i see a few faces um so if you're if you're interested in uh in um you know sharing this or, or doing something like that that would be awesome just hit the share button i would love to have more people on board today as i said today we're going to talk about me sharing what you what what you're seeing right now is this new technology I found called Be Live, and it's a real thing that you can use when you're recording your Facebook Lives. But let's kind of get right into um, some information on, on Be Live. So, um, okay, so awesome. Pat says she's planned to be here anyway. She wanted to know about software, so here I am, and I'm happy to uh, I, I, <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm happy to share that. Um, so be live. Uh, the URL is called be is be live as in b e l i v e dot tv, um, and we're. What I really love about this so far, I'm still in the free trial phase. This is only my second live live video using them, but you'll see that. Uh, as you saw, some really cool things came up on the on on the screen as I as I pressed show. Um, I'm gonna press that again. Um, because it's it's cool because it'll come it'll come and go as we want. We're talking about be live to right now. Um, so yes, it is cool because it allows me to interact. I can see your comments um, down down the the side of my screen. I can actually choose to show them during the live video, which I thought was really really cool because you know sometimes I interact with you, but if you're watching this video afterwards, you're not seeing the comments as they come in one by one. So it may seem really random that I'm thanking so-and-so for doing something and you don't know where in the comment section that, that actually happened. So it's cool that we can actually include them in, in the live video. You'll see that the, uh, the Be Live um, logo there, our banner, is actually in one of my brand colors. So I can choose to have my brand colors incorporated. I, I can change the look of that at, at any time. And my logo, uh, the Pibworth logo is, I'm still not used to this backward thing. It's up in the corner. There, <laughs> somewhere. <laughs> Um, so you can choose your brand colors, you can choose your logo, which is all very, very cool. But one of the things that I really love is the fact that I can pre-plan my agenda. So I've gone in before I, as I, when I scheduled my, uh, when I scheduled my, my live, I went in and I pre-planned the agenda. So I, I pre-planned, you know, that the banner would come up that said, welcome to the Pitworth Summer Boardroom. I can show the the call to action whenever I want to I can just say hey please share it'd be great if you if you clicked on share and, and um, save this to all, all your people I can show any of the banners that I want and it reminds me to stay on task because not you're seeing the banner but in the agenda item I have all the things I wanted to say so I don't have to you know try and rely on my on my memory and I also don't have to uh, worry about doing um, you know, writing it all out and then looking away from the screen or just appearing unengaged. So I really, really love that that feature. Um, we, uh, 
the, the other the other thing we wanted to t to talk about um, and, and if do if you have any questions about be live feel free to just kind of post them in in the chat I'm going to move on to to Facebook because I don't want this to be too too long but I'm going to move on to Facebook and the algorithm changes but if you have stuff that that you want to that you want to ask about the software or anything like that as I said I'm still new but if a if a kind of I'm techie when it comes to marketing not necessarily with software so if I can figure it out you can figure it out so let's talk a little bit about Facebook changes um, it's August 1st and for some people that's woohoo more summer for some people um, especially a lot of business owners um, it's the first of the month therefore it's a billing day we love those days but for those of us in Facebook land it's August 1st and the day the day that Facebook did something that ticked a little of us off and I understand why they did it but first let's talk about what happened so the um, the algorithms on Facebook changed so that you can no longer post you can no longer pre-schedule things to your personal profile why is that important well I'll, some of us use use third-party schedulers like Hootsuite or um, uh, CoScheduler or Buffer or Meet Edgar or any of those things. You can no longer go in and plan things that you are going to say. You could still do it on on your business page, and you can still do it in your groups. It's just your personal profile that's been affected. Facebook says it's because they don't want us to use our personal profiles for business. And I get it. I mean, I don't like using my personal profile for business really either, because that's not why people follow me there, except it is. If you're like me and you're in a service-based um, service based business, people want to get to know me before they ever decide whether they want it. Why would you bother to get marketing information from someone that you don't give a darn about? I have always been the main part of what I sell because people, there's lots of marketers out there. There's lots of people who can do really good things. However, um, you're going to choose who you work with based on who they are and how, and how you care about them. So that's, that's, uh, that's important. So if I can't pre-schedule stuff, my personal profile is often where I let my funny out. Um, I'm a little bit goofier. I post jokes. Um, just I, I'm a little bit more natural. One of two things is going to happen. Either um, I'm going to have to start letting the real me out on my business page, which is not really a bad thing. It's not a bad thing to be, be yourself. I mean, you would never post anything on Facebook on your personal or your business page that you wouldn't want your client to see, right? Ever. Okay, sorry. <laughs> so either I'm going to just start to be a little bit more natural on, on my business page or I'm going to end up um, sharing stuff that's pre-posted to my business page onto my profile. Those are the two things, two changes, two ways to get around it that I'm seeing right now. Why did Facebook do this? Well, um, because they're a business. I, in one of my very first Facebook lives was a little, just a little bit of a rant about this whole thing. And you know what? It's, I get it. Facebook's a business and they're looking for ways to monetize their platform. That's, you know, isn't ultimately as online marketers, isn't that what we're all trying to do is to find a way to monetize the things that we're doing. So I understand why they're doing it. I'm not sure that they've thought all the way through. However, I'm pretty sure the people who own Facebook are smarter than me. So maybe they have and I just haven't seen the end game yet. What, what I'm curious about is what are you changing in, in your marketing plan now that you know that you can no longer pre-schedule to your personal profile? Are you just going to go in and just post, uh, 
post post schedule all your stuff and then manually go in and, and post on, on your personal profile are you going to take the time to do that you can't schedule it out so you'd have to either post all the things you wanted to say at once or you'd have to go in multiple times to to uh, to make sure that it, it gets posted at the intervals at which you want it wanted to happen that might be one thing that, that, that you're doing um, you might be then continuing continuing to schedule all the stuff in your profile or sorry in your business page but then going in and sharing from your business page I'm pretty sure that was not what Facebook intended so there may or may not be um, ramifications if, if you start doing that I'm not sure it, the idea was to separate and if we start now posting in business and pre-posting in all the other places that's not exactly separate it's also not keeping um, it's not it's not necessarily in the social vein that Facebook really wants us to go into they're monetizing their platforms they want us to pay for our Facebook ads and our Facebook pages and our Facebook groups to be seen I get it I've said it before I get it it's okay except it's not but it is it is their business and nobody's gonna tell me how to run mine and no one's gonna tell you how to run yours we can whine and complain like I'm doing at the moment and we'll stop immediately but <laughs> what 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 are you gonna do to, to change so I'm curious um, if you have any comments I'd love for you to just um, put leave them in the comment section and we will continue to play with this new be live software that I'm uh, that I'm testing out because anything you say in the comments I can choose to show right up here on the screen so I know we have several people watching at the moment if you want to make a comment and say hello then your comment will actually show live on the video at that at that point um, so that would be that would be awesome if you choose to do that um, I think that's Basically, all I wanted to say at this point was just, oh, oh, no, it's not. Website changes. Oh, see, I, it's in my agenda, and I completely missed it. Um, now would be a really good time to check your plugins on, 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 your, on your WordPress website, especially if you have any of those auto-share plugins for your posts. If, uh, if that's set up so that every time you post, it gets sent out to multiple sources, a lot of those plugins have had re-releases and updates, and especially in, in the last couple days. So, and, and, and they have disconnected from your personal Facebook profile. So you can't use those third-party schedules. It's not just the Hootsuite stuff. It's also all the plugins. So you probably will not be able to schedule. So anything you have scheduled to go out to your personal profile from your blog is not gonna is not gonna go through. So go in, update your plugins. You should be you should be doing website maintenance every single month. You should you should you should. I know you don't want to, but you should. Because an out-of-date plugin, an out-of-date theme on your website is an open door for hackers. And uh, let's so uh, oh, see. Thank you, Preciosa, for letting me uh, <laughs> let, let, letting me practice with my with my showing comments. This is cool, isn't it? The comments just come right up. You can see them, and everyone else can see them. So yes, make sure you update all update everything. Get your get your theme in order. Get your plugins in order. Double check, make sure everything works because August first, game changed. And uh, see, this is why. Thank you, Tammy. I appreciate that. This is why I love Be Live is because I get a chance to uh, to to be much more interactive and. Your chances are the next time I go live, you know that I'm using this software. You know that oh, these my comment will be seen on the video. It gives me a chance to interact. Everyone else sees what you said in the real time that that, that you said it. So thank you so much to be live for this uh, really cool software that I am still just learning about. But if you're interested, go to be live.tv and um, 
we're going to be using this in our in our Facebook lives and also in our video marketing. So if you're interested in anything having to do with vi video marketing, I'm just starting a new blog series. If you go to pibworthps.com and uh, click on uh, click on uh, blog then you'll be able to see it. Pat wants to know if it's a, it is a great feature. And from, from my perspective, Pat, I wish I, there actually is screen sharing, but I haven't figured out how to do that yet. Cause I, I would show you exactly what this looks like. But um, I, the part, part of the screen, I can see myself and in the column on the side, I see agenda, I see who's viewing, how many comments we have, what live comments there are, and I can choose to show or hide any comments. So if someone were to heckle me, you don't get to go live. You don't get to be seen. <laughs> but um, it's really, really cool to be able to, to just integrate that. And I just think it's worth so much more we're we're interactive. We're having fun. It's really encouraging people to uh, to pay attention to comment because they they want to be seen. And so, thank you so much. Don't forget to update your website. Don't forget to check your schedule. I now have to go back and um, reschedule. Figure out what I'm going to do with the posts that I scheduled for the CAPS convention in Vancouver that I had already scheduled up until hmm, December. <sighs> Sometimes scheduling, pre-scheduling in a, in a, in a, uh, yes, it saves. Yeah. Everything, everything uh, saves. It saves in, in your videos on, on your timeline. So you can do that for other platforms. That's a question you're going to have to figure out. I think so. I think you can still download, but um, that's a question that we will ask be live. And uh, so, as I said, have a have a great great day, um, Woodrow. Woodrow. We, usually he's here, and I would just. Oh, I'm so glad that it was helpful to you, Preciosa. Um, yeah, it's. It is um, definitely a, a, a good thing to remember. So I'm I'm so pleased that I could help. So I'm signing off. Thank you so much. And as always, here is a great big Pibworth hug for you. I hope you have an awesome day. And thank you so much. Tune in next time. Bye now.